So I'm watching the Cam Newton and uh, Dr. Uh, Cheyenne Bryant interview, and I see a lot of conversation and discourse around the content, which is important, and I think her content is exceptional, but that's also not the focus of this video. I think there's another point here. She is a masterclass on owning a narrative and personal branding. So Cam Newton asked her a question that was just like, so where are you from? And most people in that instance would have just been like, oh, I'm from LA. And that is very clearly what Cam, he wanted like simple flat answers. But she was a masterclass in owning and storytelling a narrative that would further her image, further her own practice. And whether she did this intentionally or not, uh, she created a personal brand in that moment. She didn't just say, I'm from LA. She talked about her incarcerated father, her trauma that she's um, had, her family lineage. And she used this opportunity to also impart therapy and wisdom. Whereas most people would have just stopped here, she took it here. And when you're in these like very short, new cycles or there's like very short clips you want to take ownership of your narrative every second that you get she was on it and it was just uh it was so good she was a master class in emotional regulation understanding she understood from a business perspective why she was there this is a highly sought after platform she knew she had a narrative to uh to portray in this very short moment and she was able to access her agenda which was being able to therapize being able to get views and clicks and all of that uh, regardless of Cam Newton, who is trying to serve as a distraction. So I really say all that to say, oftentimes you only have one opportunity to storytell before people click off, whether you're sitting on a panel, you're introducing yourself at a networking event, you're on a podcast, all take every opportunity and make it into your own story. Like you are driving the conversation. It is up to you to draw people in. And I and also she was intentional like note how she was wearing her nameplate on her on the show she knows that millions of people are going to be watching this and if they don't remember her name she's going to wear it that was a signal of personal branding she also was creating cognitive dissonance because she was wearing this like very sexy dress with the heels she looked gorgeous like absolutely stunning totally appropriate but you are now intrigued visually it's also creating cognitive dissonance like she's also so brilliant i think this was a master class in cultivating and creating a personal brand and having an agenda of uh, furthering your business and knowing what time it is.